lost your ticket. You know you bought something you lost. You have no idea where it is. And hopefully you never saw the numbers then. <laughs> right? Because or you don't know. always play those numbers. Wouldn't that be the worst? Oh. I always play those numbers. Really? Yeah, really I do. Where's your ticket? <laughs> don't have it. <laughs> Whoops. Oh, all right. Well, you know what? Our numbers have been in the triple digits as far as heat index goes today. And I expect that it'll continue into tomorrow. Even Friday, it's possible. You know, today we did have a lot of sunshine, minus some of the storms across the area. So that was nice. If you were headed out to the pool tomorrow, get out early as we have got temperatures starting in the low 80s and dry conditions, meaning no rain expected in the morning, but really humid air. There's your sunshine over High Point University today. By tomorrow afternoon, we will have some clouds building and we'll look for a few thunderstorms to develop. High temperature tomorrow, 94. It's hot and it's humid, so heat index values once again will likely get above 100 in a few spots. We combine, of course, the temperatures and the dew points, that moisture that is in the air, and that leads to the heat index or what it feels like for you to be outdoors. You want to make sure that you're not doing anything that's too strenuous, and if you do have to work outdoors, please take those breaks. We need you to do that. Pay attention to your body too and make sure that you are taking care. 95 was the high this afternoon. Didn't set the record. The record was 97 from 1926, but this is unusually hot for us this early in June. We've had a stretch here. 91 on Sunday, 93 Monday, Tuesday, up to 95 today. I anticipate temps in the mid 90s tomorrow. Average about 94 continuing into Friday. We will get some cooler numbers into the weekend and some less humid air. Less humid meaning dew points jump back into the pleasant category below 60. Right now we are up and over 70 for dew points, so it is definitely miserable. Dew points running in the low, mid, even upper 70s, which is also kind of unusual for us and especially for early June. Our heat index values, even at 11 o'clock, it feels like it's 90 degrees out there. Temperatures are in the low to mid 80s. So we've got 82 in Lexington, 81 in Mount Airy, 78 in Burlington. Plenty of heat as well with heat index still at 95 in Columbia as well as Charlotte. Those feels like temperatures today were close to 110. Dew points across the area. Pretty thick and soupy here, but notice what's happening to our east. Yeah, there is a boundary here, a front that is draped right through the eastern half of North Carolina. They have dry, refreshing air along the coast. And for us, we've got the muggy air. The storms were able to be over the southwestern part of the mountains today and then kind of pushed farther to the south. We still have that marginal risk for a thunderstorm tonight. I don't see a whole lot upstream that's coming our way. Notice where all the severe weather was today down to the south, and you can still see some thunderstorms there. Everything moving around that ridge of high pressure still. So tomorrow we'll look for a few more thunderstorms to develop in the afternoon. The exact track is hard to determine, but I think there's an opportunity for some storms in our area. High temperatures up to 94. We'll look for temps in the low 90s across the foothills with heat index values that could be close to 100. Right now the Weather Service has not put a heat advisory out for tomorrow, but just go ahead and know that it is going to be really hot and uncomfortable. Could put a stress on your body. For the mountains, a high of 85 tomorrow afternoon. Also with those storm chances late in the day, we're in that marginal risk for Thursday and then heading into the weekend. We've got much better weather for you. Look at this in Kernersville. Big event corners Farley and we have got a high temperature of 87 low humidity and for Father's Day. Great temps will be in the upper 50s close to 60 and then a high of 84. That's normal, but what is not going to be so normal is less humid air, especially Sunday morning.